Jays Extra. Here at McKeon Park, the Anglers Extra pregame show rolls on before Chatham and Hyannis. It's time for Catch of the Day. I'm Ben Schulman, joined alongside McLennan College outfielder Garrett Martin. Garrett, thanks for coming on. Yeah, thank you. First day activated today for the Anglers into the lineup. How was the trip up to Chatham? It was pretty quick. I know I got a call on uh, Wednesday, I think it was, and I was out here Thursday morning, so I'm excited to be here. What was the message from Tom Holliday when he first called you? Uh, he was just saying they lost a few guys with the draft and everything, and they needed a few more position players, and gave me a call, and uh, I was ready to go. What were you doing this summer before you got to Chatham to stay fresh? Uh, I was just at home. I was lifting, hitting, throwing every day, just kind of staying ready for if I ever did get a call. What is it like now to step in from just doing personal workouts to now live pitching again? Oh, it'll definitely be uh, it'll be tough, but I'm excited to uh, to see live pitching and uh, and actually be back on a field. So it'll be fun. Any advice from the coaches on how to get your feet wet in this first game? Uh, just kind of see some pitches, get your timing. Uh, just kind of just get out there and get ready to go. So you're one of three McLennan guys in this game tonight. Dominic Tamez for Chatham's on the bench, Mason Greer on the other side. For those who don't know anything about McLennan College, what would you tell them about the school? Uh, it, it's really a powerhouse junior college. We have we have Division One talent, and we're playing junior college baseball. So it's it's a lot of fun playing with a lot of good players like that. What are some of your top experiences from your time at McLennan? Uh, definitely winning the junior college World Series. That was that was awesome. What makes junior college players different than D1 guys who are coming here? Uh, but junior college guys are just grinders. You know, there's no rules in junior college. You're out on the field all day playing a lot of games. So definitely know how to get up when you're tired and play. Is there a bond even with the non-McLennan guys here who you've played against maybe at other schools? Oh, yeah. All, all the junior college guys kind of have some bond together. It's an unspoken thing. They just have some respect for each other. You step into this Chatham team in part of their hottest stretch of the season. What's it been like to fit into the mold of a team now over halfway through the year? It's been easier than I thought it was. We got a, we got a bunch of good guys, and um, I feel like it kind of just fit right in. What do you do to build those relationships with some of the guys you don't know? Uh, there's a lot of bus games, uh, a lot of games in the dugout, and just kind of fun to watch and kind of jump in when you can. What's your favorite bus game? So they've, been, they've been playing passwords a lot. This is a new one for me. I don't know passwords. Could you give me a, a quick rules rundown? So it's, it's kind of one guy tells, you try to name a, a famous person, and then you take turns trying to, you give one hint, and you're trying to guess who, who the famous person is. So like a 20 questions with celebrities? Yeah, similar. Did you get any, uh, any answers right on the bus trip here to Hyannis? Yeah, there's, there's some that are easier than others. Well, you guys are decoding each other on the bus, trying to do the same to this Hyannis pitching tonight. Garrett Martin, thanks for taking on your first catch of the day. Yeah, thank you. That is McLennan College outfielder Garrett Martin. He's in the lineup tonight. We'll have the rest of the lineup, the pitching matchup, and more coming up on the Anglers Extra pregame show. Let's send it back to Emmanuel Barbari.